As a Windows 10 and 11 Home Edition user, you will face this error. Windows cannot find gpedit.msc when you want to open the local group policy editor on your computer. As you see in my computer properties, I'm using Windows 11 Home Edition and I'm able to open the local group policy editor without getting that error message. So not to waste time, let's jump into the tutorial so that I can teach you how to install local group policy editor on Windows 10 and 11 Home Edition. First of all, for you to install the local group policy, you can either use the text document or the Windows command prompt. Let's begin with how to use the text document to install the local group policy editor. First, open the Start menu and search for Notepad and open it. Once it's open, copy the following commands provided in the video description and paste them into the Notepad. After you have pasted the commands in the Notepad, click on File in the menu, then select Save from the drop down menu. In the Save dialog box, change the Save as Type from Text Document to All Files. Next, Change the file name to gpedit.bat. You can choose any name you like, but it must end with .bat. And I recommend saving the file to your desktop for easy access. Once you've completed all the steps, go ahead and click on Save, and then close the document. You should see the file on your desktop or at the destination where you save it. If it doesn't show up, right-click on a space on the desktop and select Refresh to show the file. So the next step you should take is to right-click on the file and then run it as an administrator. Wait for a few seconds or minutes for the installation to complete. Once it's done, the program will ask you to press any key to continue. Do that and then restart your computer. After restarting, you will be able to open the Local Group Policy Editor on your computer. Another way to install the Local Group Policy Editor is by using the command prompt. To begin, open the Windows Start menu and search for CMD. Run it as an administrator. Next, copy this command from the video description. So after you copy the command, return to the command prompt and right-click on it to paste the command. Once you paste it, the installation of the Local Group Policy Editor will automatically start. Wait a few minutes for the installation to complete. After it finishes, close the command prompt and restart your computer. From now onwards, you will access the Local Group Policy Editor on your computer. I hope the video helps, and don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn the notification on for future updates. Comment and share the video with your loved ones, and I will see you on the next tutorial soon.